This is everybody's fight. This is not a police issue. This is a community issue. The issue plaguing the community is gun violence. And according to Eddie Harris with the violence prevention organization, No More Red Dots, he says the problem is being fueled by social media and retaliation. We got a very different kind of problem now. Homicides are up nearly 3% from this time last year. There have been 70 homicides compared to 68 in 2023. Harris says community organizations are working to prevent them, but more work needs to be done. We have had 58, 58 individuals who've been referred to us either through the courts or, or through individuals or through just walk-ins. And, and all of them had gun charges, gun cases. So of the 58, only three have, have had new cases. And that's been over the last 18 months. So far this month, there have been 19 homicides compared to the 11 this time last year. And anti-gun violence advocates say that in order to prevent these numbers from increasing, you have to get to the root of the problem. So what our job becomes is how do we reduce the, the likelihood of retaliation? And the way you do that is to have relationships with, with the people who are probably going to be looking at retaliation. And other organizations are also trying to find ways to prevent gun violence. The Office for Safe and Healthy Neighborhoods now has networking nights to discuss their efforts to reduce or respond to local gun violence through their anti-violence coalitions. Harris says the more programs across the city, the better. Uh, we need every initiative that, that, that folks are doing. Everybody needs to do something, and there's something that everybody can do. In Louisville, DeAndrea Turner, WLKY News.